fashion. So pretty much I wanted to do an overview. I just got off of YouTube uh, watching Boosted Boys. Shout out to them, like, I like their stuff even though I'm a Toyota guy myself. But uh, they did a pretty good video as far as an overview of how much, it's, how much it costs to make a 600 horsepower city. And I thought it was funny because everyone's always talking about how I should throw a K-Series swap in this. It's already been swapped, uh, not K-Series, but I'll show you that in a little bit. But uh, how everyone's telling me to do this swap, that swap. Uh, MR Toyotas are more expensive than Hondas, of course they are, but I wanted to go over how much it costs to do, I am right now on a low tune, but uh, once I turn up, really just pretty much the tune is at right around about 332 wheels. I'm very conservative right now until I get this engine built. This is it, pretty much fresh from TCS. Well, about, I've been driving for about a month now, about a month, but here it is. That's, that's it really. Whoa, ah, goodness. Super dark. Super. Wish I had much better lighting. Ah, I need to build up my, my camera arsenal, but I got, another, I got another phone. Yeah, I'll tell you guys about my job later on. But, we got, let's see, turn the light. That's it. Back to so, I'm about to get in the sun. Precision 5858. What the hell is it sound? Hmm. It's, a weird, it's a weird jingling sound in here. I don't know where it's like, we got a dog or something. It's creepy. But uh, that's it with a three inch, I believe three inch uh, air intake. I got a screamer pipe. I want to get rid of this and I want to get a recirculating valve. So keep the power in the engine. Uh, I got a screamer pipe on it as well. That's pretty good. Tile, it's a Gen 4 3 SGT. So I'm right now at about 330. Very conservative, I'm only pushing about 13 PSI. I gotta turn it up. Or no, 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 no. I'm right now 290. I'm gonna knock it up to 330 because uh, I'm on 13 PSI. I wanna go up to 17, which I may be actually even a little bit more. Uh, but that's pretty much it. That's the engine. That's everything I wanted to go over. Yeah, skip that part. It's got a rust spot. That's been... I spent 2100 on the car. This is back in 2013. I've owned it for four years now. So MR2s were quite a bit cheaper than they are now. They're still pretty cheap, but the prices are skyrocketing. I have noticed that they are really going tough. So just going in short, the difference of having an MR2 compared to a Civic or pretty much any Toyota car, Nissan, stuff like that is quite a bit more. Uh, he had a 600 horsepower Civic and I'm trying to go off his number. I believe it was right around about 8,500 for a 645 horsepower Civic. I'm 330. I got a Precision 5858, uh, Gen 4 3 SGTE. What else? Uh, the, the Brembo brakes, RPF1s. Oh, and I haven't even bought the front yet, uh, the front RPF ones yet, so I'll price that because I'm about to buy those in a couple days. But I gotta pay back people, so um, I gotta pay your debts first. But uh, the RPF ones, how much is that? How much should I get these things for? I'm trying to forget. Okay, uh, the RPF ones, I'll estimate a little bit high. They're actually not high as well, right? 950 for both, for all four. Actually, no. It's about 1050 uh, for that. So where are we at right now? So 
So we're looking at 42, I spent $4,250 on the car, the RPF1s, the XXRs, and that's it. Uh, the engine and the brakes, uh, the coilovers, the coilovers were awesome. It was, I got a good deal on them there, 800. Why does it keep doing that? Okay, that. I believe that was the original number. Hopefully, I'll be roasted in the comments if it's not, or I'll probably be roasted either way. Uh, that, that, that. Oh my god, this stupid garage. I mean, oh, what? I'm stupid. Look at this. Wow. Forgot all about that. Uh, that, 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 that. that. Uh, the coilovers was that. The engine, sway bars, everything else like that. That was blah, blah, blah. This was that was blah. Okay, I'd, and it was this. I'm at $13,000 into my car right now. So that is what it costs. Not really for everyone, but uh, I know a lot of people are like, oh, well, I did it myself. Well, yeah, you can, but I wanted to have a warranty. I wanted to have peace of mind. And I wanted to have it done quick because a lot of people, they do it themselves and it's good work and everything like that, but they're also not at car meets for like five months doing it. I didn't want to be like that. Uh, that's that. That's my exhaust, engine swap, uh, Brembo brakes. What else? What else is on there? Sway bars, every little nook and cranny pretty much. Everything else in the car. So that is where it's at. So, go over a quick overview. 13,000 pretty much for the car. Uh, people ask me if I'm gonna sell it. Hell no, not just yet. Hell no. Got way too much in it. I'd lose way too much money. Or I'd lose uh, quite a bit of money. But that's it, that's the engine compartment. That's really all the money. That's the money shot right there. A lot of vacuum tubes, a lot of everything. So, love the coil packs. Exhaust is stock, slightly modified for the turbo. I want to get a uh, actual racing uh, exhaust manifold. Uh, this strut brace, oh my god. This thing in person just looks so good. That, I got some more parts coming. So that's where that's where I'm at right now, without seats, which are gonna be coming soon. Uh, that's without seats, that's without this, like without that being painted. The whole car needs to be painted. The front bumper was painted, another long story. Stupid hit and run. But uh, the whole car needs to be painted. That's gonna be in the future. Right now I'm just focused on the power. I want to get 93 tail lights, ready wing, stuff like that. But that's where it's at. That is pretty much where it is at. So, boy, don't I look dumb. Going to a car meet with how much over do I have? I have five thousand dollars more if he said, well, forty-five hundred dollars more into my car than a six hundred horsepower Civic. That is where it's at. So people that say get an MR2, it'd be cheap, put a K-Series, you got your damn mind. Cause the K-Series swap is way more than this. I mean, I don't know about everyone, but I was pricing some K-Series swaps. A basic one, just for the swap alone, bone stock K-Series of $10,000. Now Grant has a built bottom end, blah, blah, this and that, K-Series power, I don't really care. But uh, yeah, it's got, that's a really good motor, but I'm not paying $10,000, and I wanted to keep it all to you. Even though I debadged it, which I know you roast me, but that's where it's at right now. So I hope to see you guys in some future videos and hope to see you guys at car meets, everything like that. I am in upstate South Carolina, so I'll see you guys around. Deuces and have a nice day. With the problems of having no friends whatsoever. I gotta set this up somehow. Somehow. Socket right there, trying to hold it up to show HKS exhaust. So, I wish I just say like this. There we are. Hey, hey, yeah, I probably can't see my face, but whatever. Uh.
was like this pretty much it the HKS. It is actually really, really, really quiet in person. Really quiet. Like if I get on it, not saying that I'm slow, which I am, but if I get on it with a bunch of other cars, Mustangs, stuff like that, um, they're most likely gonna get pulled over because the cops can hear them and not me. The only thing you can hear from me is just the turbo spools and that screamer pipe case is pretty damn loud then, but that's that's it. That's really it. That's where it's at. What's up? Yep. Good night, baby Eva. I'll see you tomorrow. Deuces. Okay, guys, and also going back to where I left off in the last video, I, I'm not in any way roasting or saying that a Honda is easy, cheap to build, they can be expensive, but I was just comparing mine as far as prices, how much, if you're looking at getting MRT, how much it should cost um, to do a swap and stuff like that to get adequate power, but other than that, um, good content on a... Uh, uh, Boosted Boys, Honda Street Garage, Zosh, I make a shout out to C Zero Media, met him in Chicago. He probably doesn't recognize me because he met so many people and I was, like I said, 100 horsepower back then, so he was just like, just some fuck boy. But uh, yeah, just shout out to all of them, and this, somebody, this, really the people that, someone got this, oh, number one, number one, brilliant views, thank you so much, uh, look at his channel, he's the one that helped pretty much show me editing everything like that to do a YouTube video I am absolutely terrible right now he's much better than me but I am learning and I am going every single day that's all it takes just keep going that's about it um, hope to see you guys on another video deuces and I'll see you guys later hopefully at a car meet hey yo and don't forget to subscribe see I'm starting to mispronounce mispronounce words See, I need to spend more money in my school uh, rather than in my car. But subscribe to my channel. Hit me up. Hopefully, I see you guys at car meets. And uh, hopefully, all you see is my taillights.